हेलो गाइस टुडे इन दिस ट्यूटोरियल आई विल बेसिकली यूज ए पैकेज कॉल्ड एज नीडल नीडल इज एक्चुअली ए एच टी टीपी क्लाइंट लाइब्रेरी विच इज अलाउज यू टू मेक एच टी टीपी गेट रिक्वेस्ट एंड पोस्ट रिक्वेस्ट टू एक्चुअली डाउनलोड ए फाइल और एक्चुअली मेक ए रिक्वेस्ट टू द रेस्ट एपीआई सो वी विल यूज ए नोट जे एस एप्लीकेशन एंड वी विल यूज दिस पैकेज दिस इज एक्चुअल कमांड विच इज नीडेड एम पी एम आई नीडल You just need to execute this command, and you can see it's a very popular package. Over four million weekly downloads are there, so it's a HTTP client. So in this specific example, I will show you how to download an image file from a URL. So when I launch this uh, application, Node Index.js, you will see that our image file will be downloaded with a custom file name. If I open this, you will see that. So we are basically providing the URL. and downloading it as an attachment so first of all we just need to install this library by executing the command npm i needle so this is the actual command which is needed so execute this and install this package inside your package.json file so once it's installed you just need to require the needle package at the top so just require the needle package after that we also need the two additional libraries which is file system package and the path package so this is built in you need not have to install this now we will basically define a function which will actually carry out this process for us so we will have this async function and two things will be passed to this function the url and the path of the where this image will be downloaded so these two things we will pass here whenever we call this function so the url and the destination so url will be the actual url of the image and then we will have the destination path so these two things we just need to say uh, this destination path will be path dot join so the current directory and we will basically make result.jpg so we will basically have the custom file name result.jpg so downloaded file will have this name right here in the current directory and after that inside our function this function here we will actually use this uh, needle package we will surround all our code in try catch block so that if any sort of error take place we can throw this error you can console log error message so first of all as this is basically async method we will actually make a await needle this is a needle library and basically it contains it's a constructor we can call this constructor and the first argument is takes is the actual method this can be either delete get head patch post put so all these method types are supported by needle you can check out the documentation it's a pretty handy and powerful library in this specifically we are only making a get request to the actual url which is passed and the third option is takes is the response tab response type so this basically refers to which file you are downloading so we are downloading image file so that's why we will provide here buffer which will actually carry out the downloading process so now we just need to check if the request is successful or not so here we will compare in the if condition that response dot status code so one such property is there so if the status code is not equal to 200 in that case our images will be not be downloaded so in that case we can throw a error to the user like this that fail to download image so this can be either of if the url is not correct or the internet connection is not there so if the image is downloaded we can basically save it inside the local file system using the file system module we can write the file using this method write file synchronize to the destination path and then the actual uh, image which is present inside the response body property that's all so now we can console log another message that is image downloaded successfully this is now your application complete so here we just need to replace the url so just go to any url and go to copy image address and basically here you can paste the url here 
and uh, just pass this URL and the destination path whenever you call this function so you will see we are passing these two things right here whenever we call this download image function so these two things are passed inside this function and right here we are actually passing this right here so whenever now la launch this application here if I run this application so you will see basically result.jpg is created and uh, the image is successfully downloaded so in this case guys you can see that we can successfully use this needle package inside our node.js application to download an image file from the url thank you very much for watching this video please hit that like button subscribe the channel and i will be seeing you in the next video